Many gamers claimed that the 90s were the golden age of video games. In fact, many important titles and franchises in the world of games emerged at this time. Not to mention many milestones and events in this decade. Many people remember their childhood time and have beautiful memories and an intense sense of nostalgia. And in this video we're going to talk about great games that were created in this era and that are still played today because they have aged so well. It is very likely that these games will remain popular for many, many years to come. StarCraft StarCraft was released in the year 1998 and had amazing graphics for the time. The game was a sales success reaching 11 million copies sold. And even today the game still continues with beautiful images. This was a game that has aged very well. It is worth remembering that he still had a remastered version that was released in 2017 for PC. Metal Slug When we talk about games from the 90s, we necessarily have to talk about the great success of arcades and consoles, the Metal Slug franchise. To this day players around the world remember this great classic in retro gamer community groups. Fortunately, the games in this franchise had their home versions and many players were able to have a lot of fun. Metal Slug, in addition to being and still being very successful, was a franchise that has aged very well and is still worth playing today. Marvel vs. Capcom series In the 90s Capcom released three arcade crossovers that were later ported to home consoles. X-Men vs. Street Fighter, Marvel Super Heroes vs. Street Fighter, and finally Marvel vs. Capcom, Clash of Super Heroes. There are three great titles that don't get old. I particularly like the second release more than the first. But all the titles released in this decade have aged very well. Because of technology and emulators it is possible to upscale and increase the resolution of many games. So they get even more beautiful graphics. Final Fight When we talk about beat em up games, maybe the names that come to mind are titles like Final Fight and Streets of Rage. And as expected, we can definitely put Final Fight on this list. Capcom released a trilogy that is still loved by those who like a good old game. A curiosity about the trilogy is that only the first version was cross-platform. The other two games in the sequel were exclusive to the Super Nintendo console. Streets of Rage and as previously mentioned, we also have to talk about Streets of Rage, which also had a trilogy released exclusively for Sega consoles at the time. Remembering here that in 2020 the title Streets of Rage 4 was developed and published by the company .emu. The game was as good as the original with the advantage of being available on multiple platforms. Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 If we're talking about games that have aged well, we can't forget about Mortal Kombat. In this list, we will put the game Mortal Kombat 3. In addition to closing with another key, the trilogy also received two updates, Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 and later Mortal Kombat Trilogy. Available in arcades and consoles, this game made many young people have fun in the 90s. With graphics well ahead of its time, it is still admired by those who enjoy old games. Crash Bandicoot The PlayStation was the most popular console of the fifth generation of video games and many titles were released for this console. In addition to having a very large library of games, many genres emerged in this generation when consoles began to support 3D games. And from this generation we can mention here several games that have aged very well. However, our chosen one to be part of this list was Crash Bandicoot. 
We can mention the trilogy because after the launch of the first title the other two were very well improved. As previously mentioned, with the advancement of technology, emulators are improving these games even more and here you can check out gameplay with improved graphics from the Duck Station emulator, which makes PlayStation games much more beautiful than the original console settings. If you have a PC, this emulator is worth checking out. Donkey Kong Country SNES. Again let's talk about Trilogy. This time we go back a generation to talk about Donkey Kong Country. This game was one of the most outstanding of the 16-bit generation, perhaps of the decade. Magazines at the time treated the novelty as the eighth wonder of the world and said that it was something never seen before. Certainly at that time many magazines put Donkey Kong on the cover to sell more copies. With great success, other games in the sequence were to be expected. The second game in the series came even better. Many players say that the second version is the best of them, but others prefer 3. Sonic Genesis Mega Drive The Sega mascot needs to be on this list. Not only because it's a game that never gets old, but also because it was part of many players' childhoods. And it doesn't stop there, many fans are constantly creating fan games, mods and hacks, proving that the franchise is much loved and admired by gamers. Remembering that if you want to play Sonic again, Sega has made available all the franchise games released for Genesis slash Mega Drive on Google Play Store. So if you have a smartphone with the Android system, you can install the games and remember the good old days. Super Mario World SNES Released in 1990 Super Mario World made many people have fun spending hours and hours in front of the TV. The game is over three decades old but still remains popular among many gamers. The game has not only aged very well but even today it has been winning over new players who play through emulators or even through the Nintendo eShop. There is a very strong community that love to create game mods. The Super Mario World Central.net website has thousands of mods that can be downloaded and played anytime you want. The site was created in 2006 and may even have been the inspiration for Nintendo to create the game Super Mario Maker, which appeared for the first time on the Wii U console in 2015. Another very interesting thing is that many of these modifications are made to improve the game. An example is this modification that you are seeing now. It was recently made by a gamer named Vitor Valila, which allows you to play Super Mario World in 16.9 widescreen. Unfortunately, this is not playable on console yet as it only runs on the BSNES emulator that can be installed on a PC. But now I want to hear from you. I bet you know of a game that has aged very well that I didn't mention on this list. Write below in the comments and share with us. And don't forget to like the video.